I think I'd put a metal roof on. It's cedar shingle sided. The Mattawamkeag River, it's a pretty big deal. That's one thing you're going to be enjoying at your Mr. Fix-It house that you're going to repair up in northern Maine. There's a garage. You're right across from the river. There are deer. The house got a hole in the roof. It needs work. It's priced to sell. 24 by 18 be the size of the garage. It's got some problems with the door, but there's this cement floor. Little parlor wood stove in the corner. Got a pot belly. There's odds and ends, those are all the trash and treasure that comes with this property. At least you've got a garage with an asphalt roof. This garage is in such great shape. There is a screen house, not used this time of year. Are you looking for a Mr. Fix-It home? In a hidden location for cheap vacations and to stretch those monthly retirement checks? Hunt fish right across the street. You can hear a snow sled whining in the background. Ice fish over at East Grand Lake. Got a nice looking apple tree too. The first thing to do is fix that roof. You're right. This house was not staged. Two kitchens, two pitcher windows. There's a wood stove in this room. Can be a little dining area with that pantry closet, the regular closet. These are the plywood cabinets in the newer kitchen. This must be what was the original kitchen. Picture this as the camp up in Maine in Wood of Pitlock or Reed Plantation. Circuit breakers and the power's on. I saw the outside light that someone left on for us like Hotel 6. This would be a K1 heater in a living room. Another picture window like the one in the kitchen. These could be first floor bedrooms. Again, it's a hunting, fishing, sportsman's retreat. Or you start over with something using the well, the septic, the lot, the spot across the river. Got a 10 gallon electric water heater. It's got a, looks like a submersible pump. This is your bathroom with a toilet and a shower. Four rooms down, two bedrooms up. This big bedroom could be divided in two. This bedroom has two closets. If it's just your recreational camp up in Maine, in Arusta County, I'd get a dumpster, clean it out, call it good, fire up the wood stove. But if you're thinking let's make it into a home, something a little more substantial, gut it, re-insulate, rewire, jack and level. But you got a garage, you got a house, and a low price tag. I'm Maine Realtor Andy Moores. Thank you for watching the Maine Real Estate Channel. Please like this video. Subscribe to our channel if you're not already a member. And please look below. Make some comments.